In this lesson, we're going to calculate missing angles in a triangle, and we're going to use the fact that angles in a triangle add up to 180 degrees. So angle A plus 40 degrees plus 60 degrees will equal 180 degrees. 40 plus 60 is 100. So A plus 100 will equal 180 degrees. So if we take away the other two, or the 100 from both, then angle A must be equal to 80 degrees. And we can check that, because 80 add 40 add 60 does make 180. The question B, we know this symbol here means 90 degrees. So angle B, plus the 90 plus the 60 will equal 180 degrees. We can add these two together. So B plus 150 will equal 180. We can take away the 150 because that will leave us left with angle B, which is 30 degrees. For angle C, we know C plus the other two angles, 35 and 55, will equal 180. 35 at 55 is 90 degrees. So C plus 90 degrees must equal 180. Take away the 90 from both sides and C will equal 90 degrees. So clearly it's not drawn to scale but C is 90. And finally, for question D, we know this symbol and this symbol means the two lengths are equal. This means the opposite angles must also be equal. So if this is angle D, so is this. So now you have the 20 degrees plus this D plus the other D, must equal 180. So 20 plus 2D will equal 180. We'll take away the 20 from both sides. So 2D will equal 180 take away 20, which is 160. And because they're both equal, we can divide by 2. So D will equal 80 degrees. We can check this works. We have 20 plus 80 plus 80. 20 plus 160 does make 180. Thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful. And check out mrmathematics.com for the full lesson and worksheet.